A child sex predator once found to be unwilling or incapable of controlling his urges wants to be released back into the community. But a court's heard the address being considered is next door to children. Authorities have struggled to find suitable accommodation for Gavin Schuster, who spent much of the past 19 years behind bars. In 2000, he was detained indefinitely, but was released on licence eight years later, which he breached within months. Now Justice Sulan's considering an application for Schuster to live at a northern suburbs facility. A corrections manager told the court they're trying to determine whether a neighbouring property's a family daycare centre. A public playground's also nearby. There's always going to be children in proximity. It's a matter of wherever there is a risk, we try and manage that and work with Schuster to keep the community safe. We'd have to look at reducing restraints as far as Schuster going out and acting as a normal member of the community. At the end of the three-year licence, he'd be free without restriction. The court heard police concerns about the possibility of another sex offender returning to the facility and influencing Schuster. The question was raised of whether neighbours would be told if Schuster moved into the facility. And the court heard that previously when he was released, that didn't happen because of privacy and vigilante concerns. I wouldn't want them in, in the street. I'd be uh, more cautious on uh, keeping my child safe. We just want to know for safety, I guess. Justice Sulan will inspect the accommodation tomorrow. Michelle Vella, 7 News.